Tracy Mallet, happy Valentine's Day. Yes, it's the month of love. Yes, the month of love. And I'm gonna share some top secrets that are gonna help you in the month of love. So let's start with number one. Let's learn how to use our pelvic floor correctly. Number two, let's increase our flexibility. Number three, let's go for endurance. We need to go for a long endurance. So stay tuned. I'm going to give you those three hot tips. How do you get this to work? <laughs> you squeeze the foot. I'll be moving you. Oh my god. Oh, the ears move. Wait a minute. Oh, MG. The stronger the pelvic floor, the stronger your orgasm. So let's get rocking. Grab a pillow if you're lucky to have a little stuffed, my lovely stuffed toy. You can put it in between your legs and come into that quadruped position here. And all I'm gonna ask you to do is squeeze the toy or squeeze the pillow over here. Now from here, we're gonna exhale. As you exhale, draw the abs in and think of pulling the pelvic floor in off the back as you go into that pelvic tilt. And then inhale, come back out to a neutral position. So you exhale, draw those abs in, pull the pelvic floor in, up and back, and then back down. So you want to imagine you're tilting the pelvis forward, and as you tilt, it's like a kegel. You're lifting the pelvic floor like an elevator, and then we come back out into a neutral position. Okay, you want to do as many as them as you can. It's basically pelvic tilts. Inhale and exhale and lifting the pelvic floor, kind of like a little elevator going up. It's almost like your sit bones that you sit down and pull them together. The stronger you can contract that pelvic floor and as often as you can, at least 30 times a day, 30 times a day, yes, 30 times a day, you will get a strong pelvic floor. So try it. Number two, let's talk about flexibility. So you want to Keep the hips as open as possible, right? So let's go into this perfect stretch, which is the butterfly. Heels together, place it right here. And we're just gonna go into that nice little stretch. Push your elbows there, just press down. So your spine is extended, you're gonna open up your hips. You wanna really open up the hips, keep that flexibility going in the hips, okay? This is a great stretch. And obviously, as you get more flexible, you can open your legs out into that stretch. Remember, you have to hold the stretch for at least one minute and you should be doing flexibility every single day. Number three is endurance. Well, need I say any more? Endurance is really important. So why don't you go and run, go hike, go swim, get your heart rate up for at least 20 minutes simultaneously. So for 20 minutes, you keep on going, keep on going, build your endurance level up. Your partner will be very thankful for that. Okay guys, remember, it's the month of love, give everyone a hug, especially your cuddly toys, tell them how much you love them. Bye guys, don't forget to share, see you soon.